Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to pass hidden pre-chat values in Salesforce messaging for in-app and web from Experience Cloud site. First, create a messaging settings. So here in my messaging settings, I created uh, this and uh, I'm using uh, routing type as omnichannel flow and here I'm selecting my flow. In, in uh, Since we are going to have pre-chat, the routing type should be OmniFlow. So I have selected the routing type as OmniFlow and then I have selected a OmniChannel flow. In my flow, I created a, a variable of type user ID and then I'm using that in the update messaging session, um, update records element. Here I'm updating messaging session record I'm getting the messaging session using the record ID in the omnichannel flow. And then I'm updating a custom field with this user ID. Um, since it is going to be an experience cloud site, I wanted to find the ID of the user in my messaging session record. So I'm using this uh, custom field, which is uh, a custom text field of length 18. Okay, so my flow is also ready. And here I'm routing it to a bot. Okay, messaging uh, channel is ready um, and also um, my OmniFlow is ready and uh, in my and, and in the messaging channel, the same uh, uh, channel, I have added a custom parameter uh, with the API name user underscore ID, label is user ID and I have also done uh, uh, the mapping, parameter mapping here. Uh, user ID, user underscore ID is the uh, name of the custom parameter in my uh, channel and this user ID is the vari flow variable name. So this is the uh, um, API name of the variable. So I have done the mapping here. In my uh, uh, embedded service deployment, pre-chat is uh, active. I have selected this particular user underscore ID as the hidden pre-chat fields. This is my experience cloud site. This is uh, the, if you go to the builder, go to settings, go to advanced, go to edit head markup and add this code. Here, Exactly what I'm doing is whenever the messaging uh, um, is ready, I'm getting the um, current uh, logged in user ID using a yes, subject type dot current user dot ID. I have a console uh, log dot log statement to print what is the ID and using embedded service underscore bootstrap dot pre chat API dot set hidden pre chat fields. This is the uh, API name of the custom parameter. And uh, um, and here I'm passing the user ID, which I'm getting it from uh, subject type dot current user dot ID. Uh, please check my uh, video description. In the video description, I have shared my blog post. From the blog post, you should be able to get this sample script for reference. So this is my hidden uh, pre-chat field value. I'm going to pass it to user ID. And in my flow, I'm updating the messaging sessions uh, user underscore id underscore underscore c field value with that uh, user id. Okay, let me go offline. Let me go online. This is my embedded uh, service chat hosted experience cloud site. Um, I have logged in as an user. I'm going to initiate a chat. Test, 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 test dot com testing uh, before we test it currently the messaging session number is 135 let me initiate the conversation so now it passed the current user id and then it would have created the messaging session okay so this 136 is the newly created messaging session if I go here, 
I should be able to see the user ID. So using this simple script, we should be able to pass uh, hidden pre-chat fields values uh, from the experience cloud site whenever we are using Salesforce messaging for in-app and web. I hope it was helpful. Thank you for watching.